And welcome back to Crash Bandicoot versus Koala Kong. Let's do this. Now that is one buff koala, if that is the correct thing. Yes. And I assume this is Cool Jesus. <laughs> Are those like the Lego Spaceman crystals in the background? Can't catch me, you buff fuck. Ooh. What happens if you walk over there? What if he beats you? Uh. Can't catch me. Can't tame me. Can't tame me. That's not good. If you're crack, you just slowly turn around. It's weird how after after the first time ow nah, I was out of ow I was out of the keyboard again. It's weird how after the first time you get hit by that you would have thought not to do it again. Stupid programming patterns. Yeah, I mean like it's common sense, isn't it? You wouldn't just do the same thing over and over and over again that got you hurt prior to what already happened. Oh, damn you. Yeah, keep flexing your muscles, you fat fuck. And shake your ass. Is that what he did? Did he just shake his ass at me? Dude, beggar. I think the best strategy is to just keep running from side to side and hope that the balls don't hit you. But when it comes to this point, you just let the boulder get in the middle because then he has the best angle on you. Or at least the middle to compare to him. Yeah, he just shake his ass. Have that, mate. Oh, his waist. Well, I guess there is a situation that you can't really run to the side if a TNT is active, but this boss shouldn't be too hard. I wish I was as strong as this guy, but then again, that'd be superhuman. And also, minecarts with only two wheels. What logic does that have? I mean, how are they supposed to keep balanced? I spun that from the complete wrong side, but it still flew at him. Oh! I wonder why it keeps freezing like that every, two, every so often. Ah, big one. Yes, he's dead. I didn't take as long as I thought I was going to with the previous fails. Loading. Now we're on the third island, yay! I wonder how we got that far. So anyway, I'll see you next time in Heavy Machinery.